A historic covered bridge in Princeton, Illinois, that's almost 160 years old, now needs major repairs. That's if they can get done. The red covered bridge partially collapsed after a semi-truck crashed into it. Crews spent the day clearing debris and making sure the surrounding area is safe for people who live in that area. Our Quad Cities' Jackson Rosinski reports it's one of the last covered bridges in Illinois. I'm in Princeton, Illinois, where the red covered bridge just north of town has partially collapsed. The bridge was fully operational all the way back to 1868. I spoke with the Bureau County Historical Society about the partial collapse. Heartbroken. My grandparents used, used that bridge. Uh, my parents used that bridge. We all grew up with that bridge as part of the fabric of this county. And to see it in wrecked as it is, it's just, it's just heartbreaking to see. The red covered bridge was added to the National Register of Historic Places in 1975. The History Center in Princeton wants to see it restored. The History Center will be a part of any program to restore and we will help support in any way that we can. However, that may not be possible. A bridge that old, even though it has had some refurbishing in its history, may not be capable of being restored, but let's get some facts before we do that. Poppins says he knows people will rally around the historical bridge. I would hope that there is a restoration plan. The, the bridge is so iconic to everybody here that I think that is what the community and the county will demand. We are waiting to hear back from officials for the cause of this collapse. However, earlier today I did see a semi truck leaving the scene with the roof of the trailer looking as if it was torn off. In Princeton, Jackson Rosinski, Our Quad Cities News.